What is up, y'all? Here in this one, I will be showing you guys yet another easy solo car duplication glitch working right now in GTA Online. Uh, this is the MC Clubhouse solo car duplication glitch, but we will be using a Issy instead of a Death Bike for this method. So yeah, very, very cool, guys. As far as the requirements, you will need an MOC with a personal vehicle storage in Bay 3 stored in the bunker. And in the back of the MOC, you'll want any bike that you may have uh stored in the moc don't worry you will not be losing this motorcycle uh, as long as it can go inside the mc clubhouse just make sure it is stored in the back of the moc before we start here uh and then of course you will need to own the mc clubhouse as well and inside the mc clubhouse make sure you have some fagios or uh, sanchez's or any bike you do not mind losing stored in the mc clubhouse uh and then that will be it as far as the requirements so with that being said let's go ahead and jump straight on into it All right, guys, so first step here, we're going to go ahead and call a mechanic and request for the vehicle. We are looking to duplicate like a fully upgraded Arena War Issy, uh, and we're going to go ahead and request for it's on the map here. Now, if you have the bunker uh, that I have here, the farmhouse bunker, and the, the vehicle does spawn over at the uh, highway there, instead of running all the, way, all the way over there to get it, what you could do is go ahead and just start up a Titan of a job and then back out, and then the vehicle should spawn next to you. Or if you have a custom job by the bunker here, you can go ahead and start that up and back out as well. Uh, then once the vehicle spawns up next to you, uh, just go ahead and jump in and then pull it into the bunker. And then once it's in the, in the bunker, we're just going to leave it here in the bunker. You can go ahead and just park it anywhere. Leave it right there in the parking spot if you if you wish. Uh, but go ahead and just leave the vehicle inside of the bunker and then walk out on foot. Once we walk out on foot, we can either job teleport or fly a buzzard over to our MC clubhouse. Make sure you're not using any personal vehicles at this point. Uh, so go ahead and fly or job teleport there. Once you're inside your MC Clubhouse, you're going to jump on a Sanchez or a Fagio here, and you're going to go ahead and hit right on the D-pad to bring it inside of the Mod Shop. Once you're inside the Mod Shop here, what you're going to do is make one change on the bike here, uh, either the Fagio or Sanchez, whatever it is you are using. Uh, this is a vehicle you are duplicating over, so keep that in mind. Uh, but go ahead and make one change on the vehicle in the MC Clubhouse Mod Shop, and then you're going to go ahead and back out of the Mod Shop and then exit the MC Clubhouse. Uh, once we exit, we're going to make our way back to the bunker. Once we walk into the, the bunker here, you're going to notice that your vehicle you are duplicating is exactly where you left it. You're going to notice here, once we jump in, the license plate does indeed change, thus making it a clean duplication glitch. Uh, so perfect. All right, guys, once you jump in and the license plate does indeed change, this is now a duplicate. Now we need to go ahead and save it. So go ahead and pull it into the back of the MOC. Accept the full alert here. Uh, and then once you're inside, this is now one successful duplicate and it is now saved. And this glitch does not require the use of custom plates, so these vehicles will be clean and they will be safe to sell as long as you sell to avoid hitting your daily sell limit. So we recommend to sell no more than one or two per hour and no more than seven per 30 hour period, and that is real time. Uh, but yeah, we uh, went ahead and successfully duplicated the first vehicle. Now in order to rinse and repeat, what we need to do is go ahead and uh, run outside here and we're going to request for any other random bike that we have in any of our garages here. Make sure it is from a normal garage and not the MC Clubhouse. Just grab a uh, random bike here and pull it into your MOC. That way you can rinse and repeat. Like I said, don't worry. You're not going to be losing the bike that's in the back of your MOC. All that will happen is it will be swapped over to your MC Clubhouse once you pull the duplicate into the MOC. But once you have another bike in the back of the MOC, you can head back outside, request for the vehicle you are duplicating again, uh, and then just continue to rinse and repeat from there. That is going to do it for this video here. I highly appreciate you all for staying tuned in. If this video did help you out in any way, or if you have any questions at all, feel free to let me know down in the comment section below. And if you were kind enough to hit that subscribe button, make sure you do turn on all bell notifications. That way you'll never miss out on any future uploads here on the channel. This has been your boy Hi Guy, and until the next one, I'm out. Peace.